The first question then the reflection was, after watching the lecture, reading the articles, and describe your thoughts towards online learning at the K through 12 level, do you think it's appropriate for students to complete online learning at, and what parameters should be in place? I thought that K through 12 online learning would be beneficial because tech classes are using technology so much these days. They just, they are implementing programs on the internet that students go to and parent, teachers can grade them, grade the assignments, and I just feel that um, online learning would be beneficial for all for all grades K through 12 not and and beyond but um at a kindergarten level it might be a little difficult to get them to sit still long enough or to engage them long enough for online learning but I've seen in first grade classes and up that the online learning has been used um, do you think every state should require students to complete an online course prior to high school graduation? Why or why not? I think yes, definitely. Because when you graduate, the, you have so many options to take college courses online and finish your degree quicker or go slower. So you have that option as well. But I feel that to get the feel of how online classes go and are implemented, I think you the students need to have a course before they graduate. It should be required. Such as, like, most D1 schools have requirements to get into the D1 program. Um, I know when I went to K-State, I had to have a foreign language and so many credit hours of English and so many credit hours of math. And so I think that to get into college, I think you should be required to or to get into certain schools, you should be required to have an online course because it's so online courses are so widely used now. Okay, it says, describe your experience with working with LMS. Which system did you choose and why? What did you like or dislike about the system and how could you use LMS as a future educator? Um, I chose Google Classroom and this is my Google Classroom. Um, it's Miss Damo's sixth grade social studies, second hour. I had historically speaking as an assignment, and the description is, in this assignment, I would like you to tell me one story about your family's past that has been passed down from generation to generation. This assignment must be at least one paragraph in length. I also, um, did major differences between Buddhism and Hinduism. And in this assignment, I want you to find on the internet 10 major differences between Hinduism and Buddhism religions. You must cite your resources. This was honestly the easiest thing to move around in. You can, you can go to about and you can tell about your classroom and um, have a calendar, open Google, and then stream. It's so easy to create an assignment. It's just... I just enjoyed working with it and I was, it got me, oh my goodness, I really want my own classroom. It got me really engaged and wanting to continue with my coursework. So it was just, I think this was beneficial for me um, to push me to really work harder to get my own classroom. So uh, it, I would say that my experience with this LMS Google Classroom was very a very positive one, so.